right, so the first step you want to do is you want to loosen your oil cap. And then I'll just leave it on there loosely. Yeah, that's fine right there. Slide some cardboard underneath. Slide your oil drain pan underneath where the drain plug is. So this is where the drain plug is. It's gonna be right here. You'll see your oil filter right next door, okay? So this drain plug here is a 15 millimeter, and then we'll just use a uh, oil filter wrench. So I'm gonna use 15 millimeter, and we're gonna break it loose. And let the oil drain. Next step is gonna be loosening this oil filter. Okay. And just let the oil drain out. Make sure you got a good handle on the filter. All right, so let's go ahead and put the drain plug back in. Like that. For the uh, drain plug, you want to tighten this down to 18 foot-pounds of torque, or just tighten it as tight as you can by hand. Either one. But you know me, I like using my torque wrenches, so. And drain plug is good to go. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get the oil filter ready. The type of oil filter that this gets for AC Ducco is gonna be PF63. And what I like to do is take oil and carefully pour it into the center, about halfway. And then obviously you wanna take some oil and just rub it around the gasket. So right at this point, this oil filter is ready to go. So you want to take your new oil filter and line it up and just turn it on as tight as you can by hand and that's good. This is when you want to just grab your brake cleaner and just spray the area. Alright, just want to dry and wipe everything off. Okay, so everything's clean. Now we can go ahead and add fresh oil. All right, so go ahead and remove your oil cap. Put our funnel in. So you want to make sure you have your funnel lined up and start pouring your oil. For the second jug, you got to count by these quarts, okay? One side is liter, the other side is quart. We need to have two quarts left, okay? So we need to be at this line to get eight quarts total in the engine. There's two quarts left in here. I'm going to save this for my next oil change. Take this funnel out and just screw this in until you can't screw no more. All right, that's it for this video. The oil is back in. It's the right level. Thank you for watching. If you like our work, go ahead, hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell for more Trick Shift Garage videos, and we'll see you on the next one.